men in Lake Naivasha have dismissed allegations of torture and killings by the Kenya Coast Guard services. To the beach management units, the over 500 fishermen and traders blamed the deaths on drowning due to a surge in the number of unlicensed fishermen. This comes after a second body was retrieved from the lake sparking fresh demonstrations along Naivasha Maimahi Road, where several car windscreens were shattered. Sisi kama wanachama ya BMU tuko na bylaws yetu ambayo inaandamana uh, fishery uh, act. Kwa hivyo tuliambiwa na tunajua ya ilikuwa imekatiliwa. Hakuna mtu yote ameruhusiwa kuingia kwa maji usiku. Na kuingia kwa maji usiku tulifunga kwa sababu ya jambo fulani. Kitu ya kwanza tunajua usiku vivoko na nyati uwe unatembea kwa maji na pia upepo inakuwa kali sana siku. Kwa hivyo tuliona watu wetu wanapata sida mingi sana kwa maji. Na ndio tunasema tulisema kama viongozi ya kwamba mambo ya night fishing inakuwa banned. Kwa hivyo wale watu vijana wao walikuwa wameangua kwa maji ni wale watu wanaingia kwa maji na mitungi. Siku hizo tunatengeneza mitungi ina ya maji ya lita 20 wanaunganisha kama nani. Alafu kifiko siku wanaingia kwa maji kuvua samaki na hizo bitungi. Na hizo ni hatari sana kwa maisha kwa sababu hizo ukiteresa tu kidogo anguko kwa maji kama ujui kuogelea uwezi kuji kwa maji kwa boti. Ujue jinsi ambavyo hii lake itafanyika kazi. Otherwise tukiangalia hivyo tutazika vijana leo kesho na kesho kutwa. Na tukipoteza uhai sio kupanda tumepanda uhai itamea kesho. Hiyo uhai imepotea. Kwa hivyo hatutaki kusikia mambo ya uhai kupanda tuko usiku wanasema ni Kenya Coast Guards ni vizuri wakuja tukae on board tujue ya kwamba ni jinsi gani tunaweza saidiana tuliwapea license wengine wao bado wanafanya hiyo kazi mbaya tafadhali tunaomba ya kwamba wakuja on board tujue vile tunafanya uhai kupotea imepotea na hakuna mtu angetaka uhai ipotee very sad for the last two days we have had some incidents within Naivasha and more so within the lake Naivasha uh, whereby some of our fellow youths have been found dead within the waters of lake Naivasha uh, we are suspecting that they have uh, been killed and we are asking uh, the government uh, Haswa Kitengo uh, Cha Imru to take caution and uh, to be involved in the post-mortem of these uh, bodies because it is very hurting uh, to see demos happening here and there and some damages have been done today of which we as readers we don't condole with but we would want uh, the truth to be known. Well, that's it for trending news at this hour.